Hey guys, on our channel Tech Brothers, you can watch many videos about different projectors, from budget to more expensive. Today we will talk about projector, which costs $260. Actually, this is not very high price for a quality projector. The hero of today's video is DB Power RD828. It has Full HD native resolution, 8500 lumens brightness, 10,000 to 1 contrast, up to 300 inches screen size, wireless screen mirroring, and digital keystone correction. As already said, $260 is not high price for a quality projector. But is a DB Power RD828 really a quality projector? Let's find out. On the box of the new projector, we can see that it has 12 months warranty, but you need to activate it. There is also a logo of a Full HD 1080p in the right top corner. Inside the box we have another card to activate warranty, and two cards to get a gift, such as a tripod stand, Google Chromecast, projector screen, or Fire TV stick. Then there is user manual, power cable, AV cable, HDMI cable, remote control, and projector itself. DB Power RD828 has a very interesting design. It has a similar shape and size to many other projectors from this price range. But I like the combination of colors black, gray, and white. As you may have already noticed, the projector has a fabric top. It is very nice to touch. There are also control buttons on the top, such as power, return, OK, up, down, left, and right. On the front we can see a protective plastic cover and projection lens under it, as well as IO receiver for remote control. Now let's take a look at the back of projector. Here we have AC input, speaker, as well as a second IO sensor, two USB ports, 3.5mm audio jack, AV port, and two HDMI ports. You know, DB Power RD828 has many different ports, so you will not have any problems with connecting external devices such as game console, laptops, TV boxes, etc. If you are looking for a focus wheel, it is located on the left side. As I already said, the new DB Power projector uses digital keystone correction, so it doesn't have physical keystone correction wheel. There is also an error filter on the left of projector. We can remove this cover and clean a filter. By the way, we can also see what's inside a projector. On the right side there is only ventilation outlet. Projector has adjustable tilt foot on the bottom. There are also four holes to mount a projector on the ceiling. Remote control is made of plastic, and it is powered by two 3A batteries. There are all control buttons that you need, such as power, source, flip, direction buttons, volume up and down, etc. By the way, I noticed a microphone hole on the back of remote control. Probably the projector supports voice control. I think that's enough about design, because we'll still have a lot to talk about. So I turned on the projector. By the way, I'm shooting this video in daytime. The projection is quite good visible on the wall. Do you agree? Later we will compare the projection with the bright room and total darkness. On the home page we can select source channel on the left, HDMI 1, HDMI 2 and audio video. Then we have iOS cast, mirror cast, movie, music, photo, and office suite. The projector doesn't have built-in memory, so you need to connect external device, for example laptop or a USB flash drive. The settings menu has Wi-Fi settings, projection image settings, language settings, settings update, other settings and about. As you understand, in Wi-Fi settings you can connect to Wi-Fi network. Projection image settings has 4-point keystone, projection mode, and digital zoom. We can also change the language of projector. There are many languages available. In the other settings we can only choose power on option, standby or direct. DB Power RD828 supports Wi-Fi, so you can connect your Android or iOS device projector without cables. For that, you need to connect to the same Wi-Fi network as your phone connected. Then go to iOS Cast or MirrorCast. The next step is to take your phone, iPhone 12 in my case, and open screen mirroring. Now just select DB Power, and the screen from the smartphone will be on the wall. The DB Power RD828 projector has a powerful 5 watt dual hi fi speaker. It is really good quality, but also it is very loud. The maximum volume is about 75 dB.
As for the noise level, it is about 51 dB near projector. and 35 dB at a distance of 1 meter. Now let's watch some videos on projector. By the way, I was very impressed by the clear image. On this picture we can see that all corners are clear, there is no blurring. You can also see the high detail of projection. The individual pixels are not visible even at very close distance. This is because DP Power RD888 projector has native Full HD resolution. Now let's watch some videos in dark room. On Iguodala. He started the semifinal game as a member of Philadelphia and finished it as a member of the Denver Nuggets. Even though he's made the point that that it wasn't 100% fit and clearly events of the last few days should have last time out. Childhood doesn't last forever, but family sure does. Hey, we get on with this? I miss my team. What's stressing you out so much? The respect for nature, the unknown, and uh, I will meet him. You understand this challenge? I do. He must seek me out, children. I forgot at the store, I could have been with her all day. I'm ready now. I don't think you are. Just admit, you're not into sex. It's kind of like you're pornophobic. Try saying something racy. Yeah, what if I that fear again? Give me a uh, get out of here! I must admit, your style is far into my kingdom, but it's impressive. That's right. There you go. Let me hear. What have you done? We're 1080, but it's that much crisper. And I'm driving a little bit recklessly while trying to talk at the same time. Oh god, it's bring high-end specs at a lower price. Now things have changed, and with the new OnePlus Nord CE 5G, they've got the mid-rangers in their deadly sights. Should they be scared? What's this sleek and durable design as the more premium Mark III experience, which by the way are still floating around in some sort of smartphone ether right now, early summer my ass crack. And for 400 quid, the Xperia 10 it's also got a 144Hz display, 6.67 inch AMOLED, and it has those shoulder trigger buttons which price a little better and to be just offering still a similar kind of package. So we still have that Snapdragon trip. Game mode and up to 32 hours of music playback. You know the features are very good for $50 DWS earbuds. Right, so the images and other elements in this template. Otherwise, you have 23 beautifully built PowerPoint slides. I also shot some videos in the bright room. Words, go ahead and make any changes if you want to this. You can also adjust the date by going into the header and footer dialog box here and by changing the content here. Yes, and controls. And view control allows changing the view in a backup camera from mirror and normal as well as upside and down. As you can see, the projection is still good visible, but the colors are not as vivid as in the dark room. I think the projector can be used for office or college presentations. DB Power RD888 looks like a perfect projector for home, because the image is sharp thanks to Full HD native resolution and the colors are vibrant. The brightness of 8500 lumens is enough to use the projector in the bright room. I also like that there are many ports to connect external devices, such as two USB ports, AV and two HDMI ports. The new projector also supports Wi-Fi, so it has iOS cast and mirror cast wireless connection of smartphones. You know I am surprised that DB Power RD888 projector has digital keystone correction. Most other projectors in this price range have physical keystone correction well. Finally, the design of this projector is very nice, especially the fabric top. 
I think it makes the projector look more expensive than it really is. However, I found one drawback. The projector blows out very hot air. I don't think it is a problem if you place a projector at least one meter away, but it is very hard to be next to it, especially in the summer when the outdoor temperature is 30 degrees or even more. Thank you for watching this video. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel, Tech Brothers.